Hello guys, Crispy, welcome back to another video. Today, my friends, I'm gonna be testing the GTX 960. This is the two gigabyte model of this card. There's a four gig variant, but they'll perform the same here in Fortnite. I'm running the latest drivers, of course, from Nvidia, which are these ones, 446.14. This one is the gaming version from MSI. So yeah, it comes already a little bit overclocked out of the box. And I'm running it with a Ryzen 7 3700X and 16 gigs of RAM. And I think you should be able to achieve the same frame rates with something like a Ryzen 3 3100 or even like an overclocked Ryzen uh, 5 1600, something like that should be absolutely fine to not bottleneck this card. I'm gonna be playing of course at 1080p resolution, 1920 by 1080 using the low, uh, wait a second, <laughs> yes, using the low competitive which is low with epic view distance, medium, medium no shadows, high, high with no shadows and epic, epic with no shadows. I'm running DirectX 11 because it actually runs better in 900 series GPUs. Alright guys, here we go, we're in the battle buzz, we're gonna go to Misty Meadows because it's very far away from the buzz because we've been dying for the last like two or three games, so... <laughs> Yeah, we better just go off into the distance and forget about the other squads and don't really pick fights. Okay, we're almost there. I think no squad dropped with us. Yeah, they're dropping there in Lazy Lake. I think that's Lazy Lake, by the way. Yes, it is. Uh, and it doesn't seem like anybody is going to drop here with us, so that's good. Let's start counting our FPS. As you can see, it's running really, really smoothly for now. Maybe we're going to get some stutters here and there. At least I saw a few stutters in the other games that we tried here. All right, we have Famas. Not good, not bad. Uh, yes, there are enemies there. Maybe that's a bot squad. Hopefully that's a bot squad. Oh god. Oh, there's a dead guy over there. Um, oh, 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 yeah, that's a bot squad, I think. Yep, alright, we should be fine, guys. We should be fine. What the heck are you doing, guys? Don't trap me. I'm killing the boy. Oh my god, okay, maybe it was a good idea for you to trap me, to be honest. Um, yeah, no bullets. Alright guys, we're fine right now, thank you for the small shields again, and uh, let's jump around, let's see FPS here. Uh, you can definitely run a high refresh rate monitor on low settings with the GTX 960, by the way. Just make sure you have that Ryzen 5 1600 overclocked, or even like a 1200 overclocked should be fine as well. The 1200 overclocked, however, should only be able to get around 150 FPS on average, so it's not quite as good as the 1600 overclocked, of course, but it should still be a very similar experience to this one, so yeah, you're fine. No, that's, that's a guy, right guys? That is a guy, that's not a bot. Oh god, oh god. Anyways guys, I think this is enough for the low settings. It's very, very smooth. It doesn't really stutter that much. It's probably because this is the third game that I'm making here. So everything has had time already to load in properly. And I'm gonna go ahead and stop it right there. If you have a 144Hz monitor with the GTX 960, you don't need to upgrade the GPU just yet. If you're fine with the low settings, of course. Let's do competitive right now. Start counting our FPS. And let's keep on moving. Where should we go right now? Are we inside? Yes, we're well inside of the circle. Maybe we should go to Lazy Lake. Maybe we shouldn't get into the chopper because it's actually almost dead and we're probably gonna die because we're gonna draw attention to us, but I don't care. Let's go. <laughs> well, this is a demanding test, I guess. So this, this is good, right? We're getting 120s sometimes, 110, 130s maybe. Let's go out. Let's loot this place right here. Oh my god, what the heck? They did... They exploded with the thing, didn't they? Uh, I think so, I don't see it anymore. Let's see if we can spot anybody at the distance, and uh, we're still getting pretty good FPS, by the way. Yeah, uh, the render distance doesn't really affect that uh, for some reason. We are playing on competitive settings, but that's okay. At least you can spot people at the distance very well still, so yeah, that's just weird, you know. <laughs> so we're getting slightly lower FPS than low settings with slightly lower 1% lows as well. Instead of 120, we're at 100. It's still a very smooth experience and a high refresh rate one, and we are... Oh my god, we are in the best place in the world right now. The previous Weeping Woods. And inside of the bush, by the way, we're getting down to the 80s, which uh, it's kind of not a very high refresh rate experience anymore, but still. When are you getting inside of the bush and when are you actually fighting inside of the bush? I don't know. Uh, you might actually do it, but yeah, I'm just a very bad player. I never do that. Uh, can we do this, guys? I know that I'm gonna miss this shot. Oh my god, it, it was so close, by the way. 
Right, guys. God damn it! Okay, bullet drop is insane in this game. Alright, guys. I'm just gonna go, you know? I'm not gonna stay here. This sniper fight is a little bit too boring to my taste, okay? Let's just go. Ah! Almost got him! Okay. Anyways, this might be enough for the competitive settings. We've seen enough, I think. Alright, here we go. Medium settings at 1080p. Everything else still the same. It's still loading. That's why it's stuttering a little bit here at the beginning. And let's start counting our FPS once again. Okay, it's smooth again. Alright. And it's still very playable. I don't know if you expected this or not, but the GTX 960 is doing a fantastic job. Even inside of the bush, it gets 60 plus FPS. So it's gonna be a 60 plus FPS experience all of the time, I think. I think they're inside of here. I'm just gonna trade my FAMAS for the M4 right here. Let's go. Oh my god, this is really good. Okay, I really like this weapon right now. Holy. We should go away, guys. The circle is coming and it's very close to us right now. And I don't even know where the other ones are. So, uh, that's bad. Oh, there they are. Oh boy. Oh my god, are you serious? You're always in front of me, dude. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Okay, did I hit him? No, I didn't of course. Okay, the bullet travel is so slow in this game. I don't get it. Oh, whoa, whoa. Are they behind us right now? I don't know. What's going on? Yes, they are behind us. Okay. Oh, there's one. Very close. No, nope. no, that sucks. Please don't kill me, you goddamn bastard anonymous. Ah, oh, man. Oh, rockets and stuff. That's bad. Anyways, guys, we can still see that it's running really well. Why didn't you keep shooting? No. What the heck? How can you do it with a controller? I don't get it, guys. Okay, everybody, we're in the blue again, as you can see. And we are at 1080p right now. Medium settings without the shadows enabled. Let's go. Uh, we should drop in, in in here. Yeah, Salty Springs. Salty Springs should be fine, I guess. Um, oh my god. God, look at the amount of people dropping here. We're not gonna go here, guys. We're gonna go to Sweaty Sands. Yes, let's go to Sweaty Sands. I don't want to die right now, please. Oh, God, and there's another squad going to Sweaty Sands as well, obviously. Anyways, let's see if medium settings without the shadows enabled provide us with a bit more frames so we can achieve like a high refresh rate experience or something like that. Like 120 FPS on average would be great for the GTX 950, 960 at these settings. I'm also going to be testing the 950 today, by the way. And our boys are already dying, of course. That's why I didn't want to go there. Is there a guy? Right? No, that's a shark. Okay. Thank God it's a shark. Usually I don't like sharks, but this time, yeah, I love the shark. I'm sorry I didn't go with you guys, but yeah, I just don't really want to die right away. Oh boy. Did I hear a shot or something? Yes. Okay, then. Uh, this is bad. Gray M4 and a shotgun that I don't really like too much. Okay, is this a portal? I'm gonna try it, guys, okay? And by the way, look at those averages. 123. Yeah, this is a portal. Where does it lead? Where are we gonna go? Alright, we're here. Hopefully, there's nobody around us right now. Stop shooting at me. There's another squad, dude. Oh, boy. Okay. Alright, another gray M4 right here. Let's see FPS here inside of this uh, the bush, obviously. I almost said the smoke, but it's just as demanding as the smoke in CSGO, actually. <laughs> so it drops down into the high 60s from our 1% lows, but it doesn't really. It does drop into like the low 70s and stuff like that. So we're absolutely fine. Oh my gosh, this is good. Thank you very much, dude. More bullets right here. Oh, they're very close. Okay. This is, this is it, guys. We're gonna die right now. 106 FPS on average. It's pretty much the same as medium settings with the shadows enabled, to be honest. Because the shadows on medium don't really make that much of a difference. Actually, let's go to Holy Hedges. Hopefully there's no squad here, okay? Oh, there's another squad. Okay, never mind, guys. We should go. No, no, Toxic. Why? Uh, you know what? I'm gonna leave you. I'm so sorry. I bet they'll never know that I'm here, you know? So, yeah. Okay, 108 FPS average. These are the results. Uh, pretty good stuff still. It's not 120 all of the time, but it's okay. It's fine. High settings across the board, though. This is where the GTX 960 should start to struggle, to be honest. But so far, it's above 60. This is impressive still. Okay, guys? 
this is really good and I'm gonna go try to get that thing back and then revive our boy Toxic Snipes! Ha! <sighs> I really hope that that guy didn't see us. Please, there's nothing to see here. You know what? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go away. Oh boy, please. Okay, we're fine. You know what? I don't care. I'm going. I'm gonna save you, buddy. Nine seconds, eight seconds left. Let's put on our axes and run f faster. Oh, okay, we're fine. Good, 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 good. All right. Oh my gosh. Okay, I got this. There's a reboot fan right here. I'm gonna do it. But look at those averages, by the way. So far, we've been getting 60 plus FPS almost all of the time, aside from those pesky little stutters which are lowering our 1% lows. I was really not expecting this, to be honest, guys. This is really impressive for the GTX 960. Yeah, 50 something right now. But it's still playable, you know? If you are after a 60 FPS experience on average, and if you have a 60 Hertz monitor, and if you really want to play on high settings because the visual fidelity is just way higher than medium to be honest it looks way way better and there's a chopper right there and we might we might die with those guys so let's go inside of the circle yeah it's not that far away uh, we should be fine please just don't spot us okay guys in the chopper I'm just benchmarking a GPU I'm being helpful to you as well imagine if you want to buy a GTX 960 all right let's keep on moving we're below 60 a little bit but that's not too bad I was honestly expecting lower FPS coming out of the GTX 960 this is pretty much the same I think or slightly slower than the GTX 1050 Ti so it's quite impressive what this little card can do after six years okay six years now, do I recommend you to go out and buy a GTX 960 in 2020? Probably not, unless you can get one for the right price, obviously. If you can get this for like 40 to 50 bucks, I say it's a good deal for a GTX 960. You're getting 1050 Ti performance in most games uh, for 50 bucks, that's not too bad. But, there's a big but, if you can find the RX 470 for like 60 to 70 bucks or even the 570 for 70 bucks to 80 bucks, uh, it, those are much better deals because those are twice as fast as this one. It's just gonna make a world of a difference here in Fortnite and in other games as well, especially in newer games like Call of Duty Modern Warfare. I'm gonna stop it right there. 45 FPS, 1% lows, not too bad as well. And let's disable the shadows right now. And uh, I think it's not that big of a difference, right? Oh, it is. Okay, never mind, guys. It is a really, really big difference. What is Toxic doing outside of the circle? He's just standing there. What are you doing, buddy? You need to help me. I can't do this alone. Well, maybe I can because I actually managed to win the RX 580 video alone. Uh, but still, I don't like to be alone. <laughs> okay, then. This is really good. All right, I'll take that. And let's just zipline our way out of the agency. By the way, the agency is not the most GPU intensive area in this map. Um, so yeah, it's more of a CPU intensive area than a GPU. Oh my god. Why, dude? Why did you stay there for so long? I revived this boy for nothing. It does drop from 60, so this is not the best experience ever at high settings without the shadows. I think the 1050 Ti didn't really drop from 60. I think even at high settings with the shadows enabled, the 1050 Ti didn't really drop that much from 60 FPS. Maybe it was only inside of, of the bushes, you know? So it's a little bit of a difference between the two of them, but yeah, the, 10, the 960 is doing fine. Uh... Okay, um, maybe this is my time to die. Yes, all right, I'll accept that. No! Gosh! <laughs> All right, guys, <laughs> epic settings across the board, epic settings, GTX 960, 1080p resolution. Uh, it seems like it is going to perform here, actually. If it stays above 30 FPS, it's going to be a very big accomplishment for this little card. And I think it can do it because the RX 560 was also able to get above 30 FPS pretty much at all times with a couple of drops here and there. And the GTX 960 is actually better in performance compared to the RX 560. Anyways guys, let's keep on moving.
moving here, we're counting our FPS already, and where are the goddamn chests at? I really want weapons right now and I don't have any. Why is this here for? What's the purpose of this thing? Is he pretending that he's working or something? I don't, yeah, I don't want that, thank you. Oh, whoa, 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 wait a second, I do want that. Oh my gosh. Alright, there was a... What? He's still there. The chest is still there. What the hell? Dude, don't you want to go with this? Like, seriously, I think you can do way better than me with this, okay? But... All right, thank you very much anyways. Okay, so our 1% lows are at 28, so we might have seen a few drops here and there already, or maybe those are just because of the stutters, I don't know. Let's see inside of the bush. This is still the same, isn't it? What the hell? Wait a second, this is the first time ever in Fortnite that I get inside of a bush and I don't see a huge FPS drop, especially at higher settings, so yeah. 30 plus even inside of bushes, amazing stuff. You know what? From us, goodbye. Anyways, guys, I think this is probably more than enough here for epic settings. Uh, I don't think many of you will play at these settings anyways. And we still got 40 FPS on average, which is insane for the GTX 960. So let's just disable the shadows, make it very playable again, as you can see. 60s. And uh, yeah, let's start counting our FPS. And let's get inside of a boat and drive our way out of the sweaty sands. Let's go, Toxic. Here we go. Hermes, Hermes. I'm gonna pick you up! Oh boy, okay, that wasn't really how I expected it to go. Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm so sorry. I'm just gonna grab this and drink it. Hermes, Hermes! Let's go, Her He doesn't want to go. Alright, here we go, Hermes is here with us once again, let's go! Yeah, jumping boats that can also be drivable inland. That's, yeah, only in Fortnite. <laughs> Alright, here we go, that's amazing. A flip, yep. Very, very good. Actually, I'm gonna do this right here. Oh my god, first time! First try, guys, first try! It's still a playable experience, I think, so far, it's kind of the same as the high settings. Is it actually stopped? Like, I think I stopped the counting system for... No, I didn't. This is good, guys. Oh my god. Okay, wait a second. Alright, this was a bad idea to go with the shotgun from that distance. But yeah, life is full of bad ideas. What do you expect from me? Uh, they're here inside of this house, I think, guys. We're fine. Okay. Alright, where are you? Where are you? There he is. There's the boy that I want to kill. Okay, I got him. Nah, very, very nice, guys. We did this. We actually did this. Okay. Uh, 35 off of that guy. We're going to do this. In these situations, I just wish I had grenades. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come over here. Oh, my God. I'm inside of... Yeah, God. Okay, where is it? No, no. That's a... That's a... Uh, uh, uh. Decoy. All right, I got him. Very, very nice. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's close. He's close. He's right here. He has a bazooka. This is bad. This is bad news for us, guys. Oh my god. Yep, okay. Yep, bazooka guy wins. This is it for this video, I guess. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope it was informative for you. And yeah, it's still playable here at Epic Settings Without the Shadows. So the 2014 GTX 960, which I don't even know if it's from 2014 or 15, now that I think of it. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you in the next one. Love you all. Bye-bye.